Hey, what's going on? You know who it is. You know what it is. All right, man, as I promised, I was going to make a separate video in regards to Tyson Fury, where he is, where I think he is as a fighter and as a person. As you guys know, Tyson uh, Fury, over the last year and some change, it went through a lot of adversity, a lot of, you know, drama in his life, you know, whether some of it is self-caused or whether it's he feels like he's been discriminated against by him being a gypsy. I'm not even going to go into that. I don't know nothing about that gypsy stuff, so I'm not even going to pretend to even speak on that stuff. So, but here's the thing. I've seen recent pictures of Tyson Fury, and um, he looks horrible. Uh, from what people have said, he's ballooned up to 400 pounds. And you have to ask yourself, what is boxing shape for Tyson Fury? You know, it's not like Tyson Fury was uh, ripped up when he was fighting anyway. And to be honest with you, for Tyson Fury to try to lose that amount of weight and call itself getting back into boxing shape, that's going to be a difficult task. doesn't matter who he is. Just like Marcos Maidana. Marcos Maidana then came to the conclusion that he doesn't want to fight anymore. Marcos Maidana is possibly walking around at 200 pounds. If not over 200 pounds, he is clearly not in boxing shape. He doesn't appear to give a fuck about it, and he doesn't appear to be coming back to boxing anytime soon. So, I have to say this for Tyson Fury. Even if Tyson Fury was to try to come back to boxing, you would have to wonder would he be in boxing shape? Because Deontay Wilder ain't no, uh, you know, Vladimir Klitschko. Because if that right hand touches Tyson Fury, Tyson Fury is going to be out for the count. You know what I'm saying? Keep in mind, he got dropped by a light heavyweight. I mean, excuse me, he got dropped by a cruiserweight. Yeah, he ended up winning the fight, but he got dropped. Now, can you imagine if Deontay Wilder hits him with that right hand? Tyson Fury ain't getting, getting back up. I'm sorry, that's fact. He ain't getting back up, man. He's not getting back up. So you have to wonder, is he going to technically ever get back in boxing shape? Because he's going to take a lot of work for him to trim down and just get in shape to even where he could get in the ring. Because keep in mind, it's a difference between being in shape and being in boxing shape. Keep in mind, you have to walk around and move around, you know, for 12 rounds. So how in the fuck is he going to be able to do that when he is completely out of shape? I don't think Tyson Fury will be the same even if he comes back and let's just say he gets in quote-unquote boxing shape. I just don't think he would be able to handle somebody like Deontay Wilder or, or even possibly Anthony Joshua. I just don't see him beating either one of those dudes because one, he's been away from he's been away from the sport pretty much two years okay okay real talk he's been out of the ring for pretty much two years do you know what it's gonna take to get him back like i said in fighting shape and keep in mind he hasn't been even training no he completely got out of shape so as I said before, there's a difference between being in shape and being in boxing shape. But we'll see what happens, man. Let me know what you think, man. I'm out.